I freaked this S H I P. Okay. Crazy. I know. Sick. Try it. I live my life. And I create content around my life. Okay? <laughs> featuring her has been on repeat since yesterday okay your yeah, Kendra was in her feelings oh my gosh she just spoke to my soul I don't understand how these hoes be winning and uh, being a good girl clearly don't get you nowhere I felt her when she said it depending on what you're allowing yourself to be exposed to that can appear to be the case a lot of times but, but I don't want to encourage that behavior because just because it might look like them hoes be winning, you don't know what they dealing with behind closed doors, okay? We have a tendency to take on negative outlets to deal with our problems, right? Somebody not wanting you is not necessarily your problem, okay? You just gotta stand, stand 10 toes down in what you believe in. Look, I'm learning that you shouldn't allow a man or a woman to tell you more than once that they don't want you, okay? Hey, man, it ain't But yeah, oh my God, I spent all evening, or all, not all evening, all weekend organizing my closet, y'all. When I say my closet was a mess, my wardrobe was a mess, I, <laughs> I swear, it just be so hard for me to let go of things because even like now, I be thinking of things that I used to have that like came back in style and I be like, damn, I knew I should have kept that. I knew I shouldn't have thrown it away because that would have been like so fire. So I be having a hard time letting stuff go. So I was like, you know what? I was gonna vow my weekend. I stayed in this weekend. I was like, I am going to dedicate my weekend to um, cleaning out my wardrobe like completely because my stuff don't fit in my closet or my stuff didn't fit in my closet. So I was able to clean out my closet. Woo -hoo. Pull up that, it's too fat. And so I have like this huge bag of clothes that I wanna drop off to donate somewhere. Like before I had stuff all over the floor. So um, I was able to kind of organize my shoes, hang up everything. I tried to kind of sort of color coordinate and just like separate or organize things by items. Yeah, let me, matter of fact, let me show y'all my progress, okay? Let me show, let me show you what your kid did. Y'all, let me show you what your kid did, okay? Dun, 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 dun. It's kind of, it's, it's okay. So I was kind of able to organize my closet. All of my shoes are down here for now. And then this drawer is for like workout clothes. This drawer 
Don't judge this. Look, I'm still like getting it together, but this short. Are you fucking serious right now? God damn it. Well, this drawer, damn, this drawer was like my PJs and lounge clothes. I guess I didn't put it back on the rack um, the right way. This drawer, <laughs> look, I'm still getting it together. This drawer is for like my socks and underwear and stuff. And then this is where my dresses and jumpers and like blazer sets are located. This is hanging up right here because these are items that I need to, um, kind of style and take pictures in or whatever but i was just leaving it out so i could visually see so i don't forget and then these are like my tops these are some of my pants these are like more dressy dresses and then these are like my coats and stuff right and then over here we have um my denim jeans i had like these bins i was like you know what because i didn't have anywhere obviously i don't have anywhere to put my jeans so i folded my jeans up and put them in here for the time being these are like my black pants slash leather pants and stuff i have some of my purses here i have purses in here purses up there and then up there those are like the big bags that i typically don't wear all the time but these are like big tote bags or whatever and then um yeah and then this is just like extra stuff and boxes and stuff but yeah this is my closet for now and then this right here is all of my makeup literally all of my makeup i'm gonna put that shelf up back up a little later that kind of just threw me off i don't feel like being bothered with it right now i'm like Ugh. anyways so um yeah but i still need to organize the closet more obviously to make it more functional i guess so i actually want to get some things so that way i can like organize the drawers like some dividers so that way i can organize the drawers like separate the socks from like my underwears my underwears from my bras and then i also want to get some um shoe bins so that way i can like put each pair of shoes in its own separate container and then for my denim jeans and stuff i feel like that's a good spot for my jeans because they're literally I, I literally just need a bigger closet okay I can't, the, I, I feel like I downsize a lot. And that, for right now, that's the most that I could downsize. So I think the problem isn't necessarily my clothes and shoes. I think the problem is the space. So I need more space. So in the t for the time being, um, my jeans are going to stay right there in those bins. I might get some new bins that are like cuter. But yeah, and then my purses are going to have to stay there. I do want to get some shoe bins and then some drawer organizers. Before I go out and start buying all of that stuff, I had reached out to a brand to see if they wanted to do a collaboration on uh, organizing my closet. So hopefully they're down for that because that'll be really, really good. I mean, we can do like a whole organizing situation, revamping of the closet, you know, how to utilize small spaces for closets. I think that'd be really good for content. But um, yeah, so that's that. I spent all weekend doing that, y'all. Like, this is what it looked like before. This is what my wardrobe looked like before. Crazy, I know, sick, trifling, just just trifling. But um, yeah. <laughs> but um, yeah, today is a brand new day. It is Monday. I already have a lot of emails that I need to respond to. I love it. When I see these emails from these brands, I'm like, and then your girl just signed with an agency literally like on friday so i'm so excited to see how this is going to like benefit me i also stayed up all night last night after i finished organizing my closet i stayed up all night last night like i had like this like, <laughs> i had this craving where y'all saw i made me a salad with shrimp and a lobster tail y'all i was so hungry um, Cause I didn't eat all day. Like as soon as I got done, I made me my salad. And then after that, I was on my computer trying to look for furniture, like look for more furniture. Cause I haven't fully furnished my place yet. So I'm like, you know what? All right, it's time. For the past two months, I've had a friend. She's been staying with me. She had just moved back here to Atlanta. But now she's gonna be moving into her apartment, which is so exciting. Cause I get to get my room back. <laughs> but yeah, I let her sleep in my room because one, I didn't want to buy sleep on my couch. You know what I'm saying? My couch is white. Nala just pissed me off earlier this morning because she pissed on my couch. I said, 
girl, uh, you need your ass whooped because you don't lost your damn mind. And then having a blow up bed, I have a blow up bed, but having that in the middle of the living room for two months, that just, mm -mm. I didn't, I didn't want to deal with that because my space isn't that, that big. So yeah, I just let her sleep in my room and I slept on the couch because you know, I'm gonna I'm a be delicate, I'm gonna sleep, I'm gonna sleep, I'm gonna sleep. You know what I'm saying? You, you, no shade, no tea, but you know what I'm saying? You, you know, you you just, I trust myself with my couch. Not saying that I don't trust you, man, but like, it's, but it, you know what I'm saying? Like, I slept on the couch, but I don't know about your suicide. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? But <laughs> anyway, so uh, yeah, that's exciting. I get to get my room back. Whoop, 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 that is too fast. So, I've been like looking at furniture of how I want to like redo my room and stuff. So I found like this really cute bed off of Amazon. I'm like, oh, this 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 bed is cute. You know what I'm saying? It's cute. So I found this really cute bed off of Amazon. Um, this cute wardrobe because I I don't have any um, I don't have a dresser in my room. So that's why I've been trying to like fit all of my stuff in my closet. But if I get a dresser, I can put some of my stuff in the dresser or in the wardrobe. So I found this really cute wardrobe off of Urban Outfitters that I'm gonna get. I found like this really cute nightstand off of a uh, CB2 that I want. And then um, I figured I was gonna like somehow add like a plant in there and then like a bean bag. Like I just like have like a whole bunch of stuff that I'm like looking at on how to like redo my room. So I'm like really excited about that. I can't wait for y'all to see that. I can't wait for y'all to see that. So yeah, that's that. But yeah, I need to write down my to-do list for today. First thing I need to do is respond to these emails. Technically, I'm not supposed to be doing this part because um, my agency is supposed to be responding to all my emails, but we haven't done that process. We haven't done like the onboarding process yet. We're supposed to be scheduling a meeting sometime this week, but for now, we're gonna do it because I don't wanna miss out on the opportunity. So I need to respond to these emails. I already see some that I'm excited about. Your girl is excited about. Right now, I, I decided to slow down with school and just like take my time. I'm not in a rush. Look, I'm in my own marathon race, okay? So right now I'm taking two online classes, so I need to um, just check that out and see what assignments is due this week and write down when I need to take care of that. And then after that, I'm just gonna get myself together because I look at myself right now. I need to shower, I need to do my hair, I need to take Nala on a walk. And then um, I'm gonna come back and we're gonna get into these lashes. We gotta get ourselves together. It's gonna realize in the last vlog I told y'all that somebody gave me attitude about not really showing y'all like detail step by step how to do your lashes. So we're gonna get into that today because your girl needs to do her lashes, obviously. Let me give myself some grace, okay? Hold on. This is my friend calling me. I love talking to him. Now, nowadays you tell a girl. She like, all right, nigga. <laughs> Fuck you. You have to say that nigga, that's a new nigga on IG trying to figure out. Fuck you. Like, bro, you gotta do a lot of thinking. Like, okay, all right. This girl in the past, she came over. She was arguing with her. She was arguing with her baby father or whatever. Say, yeah, you just pissed me off. I told her. He said, oh, you for the streets. I told him, yeah, I'll be for the streets. Oh, fuck you, blah, 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 blah. They going back and forth. I'm like, all right, cool. She came, she came, she saw me. You know, no for sure, chilling. Uh, blah, blah, blah. She was like, I can't believe why he's doing this. He want us to go 50-50 on certain things. I'm like, okay, I don't know the man's pocket. I don't know what your relationship is like, but from what she's telling me, I feel like, dang, as a woman, that that's your man, like, you should be able to, if there's a time he wants to go 50-50 with you, mm -hmm. or whatever, or maybe he's down, maybe, I don't know the situation, but I feel like you should still be reasonable about it, not coming to and you, you get what I'm saying? Of course. Like trying to, trying to do, shit. like I'm, I'm looking like, dang, you need to fix the relationship. Yeah. But, but it's like, okay, should I turn this pussy down ah! and say, hey, go away about your business? 
But you still gonna smash. I mean, come on. So, <laughs> <laughs> so I'm uh, uh, uh. No, really, stop. Stop it. And then after Nala gets her walk in, we're gonna get our workout. I'm wearing my, um, this is like one of my normal Bajas. I'm about to start like literally working out in my Bajas because I have not been wearing my um, shapewear and trainer and stuff. And I'm just really trying to get into snatching myself. But it's summertime, so yeah. After we take Nala on the walk, we're gonna go to the gym. me and I was on our walk called Millennial Talks. This is my first time listening to it. So I, I went back to their first um, episode on their separate channel. So apparently I learned that they, they've they been doing Millennial Talks and they did it, they started it like three years ago, but they were doing it on her channel. So they started to pick back up and now they created their own channel called Millennial Talks. And so I guess that's where they're, be, it's a podcast where they'll just be talking about you know, millennial things, right? So I was watching, I was listening to the first one and I'm 23 minutes in, so we've been walking for about roughly 25, 30 minutes. But um, yeah, I like it. Look, <laughs> I was like, damn, what's her husband name? I don't wanna keep saying her husband because he has a name. His name is Roland. So Roland in the, in the beginning of the episode, Roland was like going in. Girl, he was going him on us women, okay? Half the time, you know that the, the formula to F-boy is, after he's done doing his thing with you, he doesn't text you back for a little bit. Right. Right? Right. So, most of the time, a woman is always on the end of, end of wondering what happened with this guy. Why isn't he showing me attention? Mm -hmm. Anytime he sends you a text at 10 p.m. at night, most of the time you're gonna reply because he's the guy in your phone that actually doesn't give you as much attention as the guys that you have saved as the food guy on your phone, the guy that gets you sections on weekends, the guy that you tell you all your relationship problems to, right? Mm -hmm. The guy that the, the the friend, the friend zone guy. Right? Mm -hmm. he, he's the guy that actually doesn't give you as much time as those other guys. So of course you're gonna always reply to sex messages because he doesn't act pressed over you. Okay. Right? That's a toxic guy. But y'all always tend to go towards that guy. And then later on down the line, it's now after you've messed up with different guys, you've now learned the patterns of the bad guys that y'all choose. You now wanna go for the guy that's more stable because you're tired of being battered. Tell me I'm wrong about that. Tell me, because, tell me. I felt like he was talking to me. I'm like, I think you gotta do better. You gotta do better. So I was like, oh my God, girl, please step in. Like, please step in. So look, the topic is, are women naturally chaotic, right? Like I said, Roland was going at him. So then she, start, she stepped in and I felt like she was like holding both men and women accountable. And then now they're both on the same page. Obviously somebody, somebody has to be the villain. He probably not gonna always be the villain, not the villain, but anyways, like I was saying, this is good. I like both of them. I love both of them and their perspective. It's so funny how I was like, you know what, let me listen, let me go listen to their podcast because I've seen her post it on Instagram. So I'm so glad that I watched it because it's, it's kind of on theme with like what we were talking about earlier today and the conversation that me and my friend had. Um, Roland had made a statement where he was like, I think that 
he said it's really important for like women to listen to men. At the end of the day, men and women, we're completely different. We think completely different and we just have to listen to each other to understand one another. And Roland had made a comment. He was like, yeah, women um, yeah, definitely need to start listening to men more because men are like literally laughing at us and our foolish decisions and mistakes, so especially the crappy ones. They're like laughing in our face when we tolerate and, and accept the crap that they give us. Oh my God, they know exactly what they're doing and they laughing at us. So, woo child, I'm gonna be, um, <laughs> I had to drop it all off, I had to get my mail, but your girl about to get a workout in and she's about to continue to listen to them. And then we'll come back and shower and stuff and then we're gonna get into our lashes. But, so to a rolling, y'all got a new subscriber. Matter of fact, let me go ahead and subscribe. Cause yeah, they, come, they, they got my attention. This was so needed, I'm so happy that they're doing this. But yeah, <sighs> I'm about to go get my workout in. And continue listening. If y'all not already subscribed to the channel, I highly advise for you guys to check them out. Mm -hmm. Okay, we are back from the gym. We are fresh out the shower. Skin is looking good. Okay, I'm gonna do a full blown nighttime skincare routine. I hate that it's blurry. A full blown nighttime skincare routine because your skin had my skin has literally been like doing its thing lately. I'm right now cooking dinner because I am starving. Literally haven't eaten all day. Literally haven't eaten all day. Um, and I'm doing something different. So I've never cooked with chicken broth before. No, please don't judge me. But I've never cooked with chicken broth before. So I'm like, you know what? Let's try it today. So I'm just literally just making some rice, which is actually done. God damn it. Yeah, the rice is done. I'm gonna let that off I don't want the rice to overcook turn the heat off and then the chicken so I went ahead and I just seasoned some um, chicken breast and I'm about to take the chicken off of it right now I'm about to go on a plate I'm about to take the chicken off of the So yeah, I went ahead and I seasoned some chicken. That's the, can you guys see? I don't know, but that's the chicken right there. I went ahead and I like seasoned some chicken. I am about to, I'm gonna go ahead and take the chicken off and put it on the plate. Real quick. Cause I'm gonna use all that good stuff that's in the pan and my sauce. Okay, right? <laughs> Look, this is 
is not a tutorial on how to make whatever I'm about to make, okay? I am a content creator. I am not, I don't, okay, I don't consider myself an influencer. I consider myself a content creator. I live my life and I create content around my life, okay? And if I so happen to influence people to do things or to buy things or whatever, then so be it. But I am a content creator, I'm not an influencer. So, <laughs> everything I do ain't gotta be on influencer status, okay? This is a trial and error. My life is a trial and error. I make content around my life, which is a trial and error. And this cooking segment might be a trial and error. I don't know, we'll see. But, um, yeah, so that's that. I got my chicken, and I'm gonna take this chicken broth. I'm gonna take these, and I'm gonna like stir it up in here. <laughs> Eee, this is so embarrassing. Please don't do this. I know y'all probably like, girl, why don't you watch my YouTube video before you did this? Cause I didn't. Cause I didn't, and I don't want to. Okay, I like to I like to experiment on my own sometimes. So I ain't got no heavy creamer. I know I know that I I know that much that you it would be nice to have some heavy cream or milk. I don't got neither. I got almond milk. So we gonna we gonna try that instead. Pour some almond milk in there. Ooh, that looks nice. Uh, look at that. Okay. Mm. Let me bring this down so y'all can see. Can y'all see? There we go. We got some almond milk we about to pour in there. Hopefully we ain't pouring too much, but that should be enough, right? And then we're gonna take some cheese. Now I know you might supposed to use freshly grated cheese, but look y'all, I ain't been to the grocery store yet. So we just using up what we got left up in here. So I don't got no freshly grated cheese, but I do have the rest of this Parmesan cheese, okay? From Trader Joe's. And we just gonna take that and we gonna like put that up in there, just like it, just like it. Hopefully this ain't too much, but we're gonna do it just like that. And then, I don't have any fresh parsley, which would be nice, but we're gonna use this parsley out of the container. <laughs> I'm tired, I ain't doing all that. Then I'm gonna take some oregano. I'm gonna put that up in there. Come on. Come on. And then, I don't have any fresh red pepper, but we're gonna use the red pepper, crushed red pepper. Okay, hey. then we're gonna use some pepper. Bang. And then, trying to hurry up. Gonna stir that baby up, just like that. Mm -mm. I mean, it smells good. My cheese is clumping up just a little bit, and I think it's because either I think it's because the grated cheese. Hey, we still gonna make it work, so. Go ahead and take the chicken and put it back in there along with the original juice from the chicken. Oh yeah, talk to me baby, talk to me. And we're just gonna let that sit up in there and do its thing. In the meantime, in between time, while that's doing is while that's doing its thing, we're gonna clean up. Clean as we go so that we ain't got a whole bunch of mess to clean up when you're done. And plus, cleanliness is next to godliness. Check me out. Don't hurt nobody. Why not? Choose me why you don't love me no more. I don't need that no 
this for the same amount of time I probably got I think I got the rope first and then I got the wrong bird but I got them both from Victoria's Secret and yeah I, I feel bad I don't, I don't know if I should feel bad for talking about Victoria's Secret but you gotta give them their props they got good quality stuff and good quality bras okay you're not gonna find no everlasting bra from Target okay you just not it's just not gonna happen it's just that's just not gonna happen but yeah now that my food is finito I'm about to make me like I really wish I had some white wine. Ooh. Looks good though. Like I said, I cannot believe that I have not done this before. I feel like an amateur in the kitchen for this, but it smells good and it looks good. So I'm about to see. I should have some veggies and some potatoes. Ooh, some potatoes and some broccoli living good. Yeah. Mm. Talk to me, baby. Talk to me, baby. Mm. Mm. <laughs> mm. Okay, let's recap. Well, first, let's try the chicken. The rice and the sauce, A1. Well, let's try the chicken. Mm. The cheese is making it a little sticky. Shouldn't be cheesy, but whatever. chicken was gonna be enough flavor by itself so I season the chicken with some um because I didn't saute any vegetables or nothing like that so I literally just used everything in the for the most part I used some smoked paprika I used uh jerk seasoning like the actual flake seasoning not the sauce but the seasoning I use um uh oh onion powder, garlic powder, a little bit of salt, and hmm, I think that was it. Yeah. For and oh oh I didn't use salt in the chicken on the chicken. 
I use a little bit of celery salt. Now that is, that tastes saltier than salt itself. So you literally only just need a little bit. And then I cooked the chicken or whatever, took the chicken off, put the broth in there, used almond milk, because I didn't have any milk or creamer, heavy cream, I meant. So I used some almond milk, and then I put all of my, and then in that I put the uh, parsley leaves, no, this is fresh by the way. Parsley leaves, oregano, pepper, and crushed red peppers. And that was it. Put the chicken back in there. Oh, and Parmesan cheese. Put the chicken back in there. Let it do its thing. Pour the juices over the rice. This literally took like, I said like 35 minutes. Mmm. So good. So good. I'm about to go sit down. I'm so tired now. I don't even feel like doing my lashes right now, y'all. I'm so tired. I feel like I just wanna sit on the couch, get on my computer, do some school work for the night, and then end the night off watching a Netflix series. Actually, on mm, Amazon Prime right now, sorry. On Amazon Prime right now, um, there's this show. I watched the entire first season. They got a new episode on their second season right now. This show right here. I'm gonna um, catch up on that tonight after I get my school work. Mm! So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna call my night. I'm gonna light the rest of my candles, dim all the lights, sit on my computer, watch TV, and take my butt to bed. Okay, it is a brand new day. <laughs> We're actually two days later. So, this is what happened. I don't know if you can tell, but the lashes is giving two different vibes. Hmm. I know. So, I ended up trying to do my lashes and recording a video yesterday. And I did one lash good. And then I did the other one and I messed it up. So, yesterday I was walking around with one lash done and one lash not done this was last night so today i just went ahead and just put a strip on right because i'm gonna be recording content today i had ordered me some more lashes uh, on amazon which you can also find on my amazon storefront but it won't be in until later on today so you know i didn't want to walk around here with just one lash set on so yeah that's what happened but we're gonna record the video either tonight or tomorrow but yeah, right now I am customizing this wig. Uh, my friend Mary, she is doing a collaboration with Eunice Hair. So I'm going to go ahead and customize this wig, you know, bleach the knots, do some plucking, set it, and then we're going to be installing it on her later on today. Maybe within like the next two hours, she should be over here and we're going to do the install video. So yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. And um, I'm just going to be in my zone. So I'm not going to do too much talking. But yeah. And I also need to do my hair before she gets over here. Because the wig is definitely been on for way too long. It's sliding back. It's doing the most. But hey, it is what it is. <laughs>
not been to sleep yet and it is so frustrating nights like these are so frustrating because i have a really hard time resting my thoughts and resting my mind and just going to sleep lack of sleep is obviously so unhealthy and it's so frustrating it's so frustrating so I'm gonna go to the gym I'll go to the gym right now because anybody got time for this it's 5 30 in the morning it's 5 38 now so yeah I'm about to put on some workout clothes go downstairs get a little pump pump in come back upstairs and I don't know we'll go from there <laughs> I'm not gonna take y'all with me, but if you don't follow me on Instagram or TikTok, follow me on Instagram and TikTok because I'm gonna post a um, workout um, reels and TikTok. So yeah, of like all the workouts that I be doing. So yeah, I'll see y'all a little later. Yeah, um, I came back. I was able to go to sleep because I was so tired. Went to bed uh, at like. It was like 7 a.m. though. And now it is <laughs> now it is 2 o'clock on a Saturday. And I am up and awake. I just showered. I am about to touch up my hair. And then I'm going to start filming some. Um, well, I'm going to film me doing my makeup. And then my hair. And my lashes. I'm taking these off. Because my friend, she's coming. She's going to. She's going to bring me. Um, some lashes since Amazon I'm gonna take all day and then start doing my makeup y'all I freaked this shit -I okay your girl is looking so mother effing cute and I did some research on um, I did some research while I was doing my hair makeup y'all I don't know if y'all can tell but the quality of the camera the quality is looking so much better, I think. I haven't uploaded the footage yet, obviously, yet. But from what I can see right now, the quality of the footage right now is giving, like, A1. Because I, like, switched up the settings, which I've never done to my camera. I altered the settings. Uh -huh. Oh. I was about to say, I altered the settings. So, y'all, our vlogs should not have this trouble of, like, autofocus all the time. Cause yeah, I did that and I like, oh, I just, and I record on a different setting now. Like, ah! I can go to details about that later. But yes, my hair looks so good. Y'all know that like side part bang situation has been trending lately. I did it on my friend, I think twice already. I was like, you know what? Let me, let me, let me do it to myself. And it just looks so cute with the updo. So I'm about to put on a really cute outfit. I don't know what I want to do. I don't know if I want to save my pinstripe outfit for tomorrow. Or, yeah, I probably save my pinstripe outfit for tomorrow so I could be fly for Super Bowl. Mm, 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 mm. And then tonight, since I'm just going to dinner, I'll probably just wear something cute but chill. I don't know. That's hard, I don't know. I'm about to get dressed though, cause me and Mary, we're about to go to dinner. Me and Mary, we're about to go to the James room. Um, they just opened up a new location here in Buckhead. So, yes, I finally get to get out the house cause your girl has been in the house all week. I've literally been in the house all week. Um, cause I just haven't been in the mood to go anywhere, but tonight is Saturday night and we're about to go to dinner. And she had came over the other day. I don't know if I told y'all, but she came over Two days ago, she came over two days ago. Oh no, no, she came over yesterday, I did her hair, and then the day before that, she came over, so. I miss her, so we're gonna go to dinner. And, um, yeah. Ooh, I look so good, I feel so good. I look so good, I look so pretty. Oh, I look so pretty, y'all. Okay, yeah, let me go get dressed, and then hopefully I can record like a get dressed with me on my phone, so yeah, I'm fine.
Women is the both pay like I want you to see and then I don't have to worry I mean, about that. I'm gonna need to bring my look at that. Right don't they just look like that look they look crazy? That's hey. crazy. It looks great. You know, oh yeah. You know, That's it is. All I thought you were saying it looks great. people win and we know that i love you then i got you to the end and you snow that everybody used to show me love where it go at i was born to shine i speak my mind and get that glow back